the trade. I mean, the regeneration is always done as a tragedy and a sadness, and you know, life moves on and stuff like that. And I thought, oh, let's have a happy one. Yeah. That's, that's the only option left. That's the only difference you can do. <laughs> but let's have a happy one. And I, my theory is okay, shall I do my theory about yeah, the regeneration? Yeah. Uh, because I think there's no better place to say it. That um, I think what with Peter having been in and Colin having been in, I think down the timeline, they all separate. They all went like that. They all the doctors came back to life with right. their individual artists. It's a gift of the toy maker. And they're all out there travelling around. And it's what I'm calling a doctorverse. <laughs> wow, it's look the at this. Doctorverse. This, this is way major. This is major. Like, and I wanna no, I wanna create a future in which in which Sylvester McCoy can just arrive oh. and have an adventure. Yeah. Without you know, because one of the things about the Star Beast is to get you back and Kathleen back with to jump through so many hoops. Yeah. yeah. And you know, which is a great <laughs> yeah. story, but it's like yeah. it's like why can't you just arrive and step out the TARDIS? So hope it creates a future in which that happens. Yeah. In because when in these things, I mean, this, will be, this may not be that interesting to people who've already seen them on the iPlayer, but these tales of the TARDIS that you've done, well, obviously, you're dealing with some actors who are not the age they once were, no. and, but you're just, you're not addressing that, you're just... And no, there's kind of little lines saying, ooh, the timelines and things oh, like right, that. Okay. None, of us, none of them find it strange, I think, if we ever do another little spin. If I could... It, it's pretty hard to find an adventure stop in which to say this. Oh, yes, by the way, we yeah. once, or, you know, yeah. I think Peter Davison once was left behind on the surface of Androzani and woke up and there was a TARDIS and he carried on oh. having those adventures. Because yeah. it's exactly what Big Finish does. It's exactly what everyone well, does. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Sylvester in his says, doesn't he? He says, there are different timelines and I'm not this. I'm from a timeline in which I, I didn't change, I just got old. Right, right. And I love that. Yes, idea. and actually yeah. science fiction writers, you know, we're coming from a history of kind of linear science fiction of the 60s, 70s, 80s, where the Doctor regenerates. Now we live in the world of the Spider-Verse. Yes. And multiverses right. are yeah. the thing, and no-one yeah. has a problem following this. So yeah. I think it's time to just kind of open it up and yeah. say, they're all out there now. Yeah. Like the way Colin Baker once turned up to save Patrick Town's life. Yes. I mean, that doesn't make any sense yeah. <laughs> whatsoever. But I'm now saying that was a little <laughs> echo it was a of the Doctorverse echo. Yeah. happening... Yes. Backwards. Yes, nice. Is anyone listening to a word we're saying? Not a word. This is deep. I am. I'm fascinated. No. A deep fan of this. Yeah.